station wash. Son of a bitch. You just got charged. <laughs> Classic. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Sarge here, and welcome back to the Talent Terry Plan. Some more World of Tanks. You guessed it. The 2017 things are still up there. It's like the third. All right, everybody's going back to school. Everybody's going back to work. It's over. All right, go fuck yourselves. Anyway, a change of pace today, as we just unlocked the Sex and Mouse over here. Where's it? Where is the Sex and Mouse? There you are. Oh yeah, so wunderbar. Oh, jazzercism. Anyway, change of pace. In the tank destroyer mood, we got the 87 today. Uh, we have full camo, camo net, 97% done with our clutch braking. I put that on a long time ago. I got the 87 a long ass time ago. This thing, this thing is a pain in the ass. Mainly because the British engineers put that giant ass command hatch on top. Like, what's the point in that? This is a guy just kind of sitting in his own little tower, looking across the battlefield. Like, why? Like, let's see if we can look at this. He's like sticking all the way up in it. Yeah, he is. Look. That, that, you don't need that. You really don't need that. Giant ass command hatch. Up on top of that motherfucker. Look at that shit. He's like right there. So stupid. And then the armor. The armor's really good, but look, look. That command hatch. Oh. Oh. It only has like 90. Oh. Oh. 90. 91 to 120. Oh, man. Oh. All this... All this armor at the front, because that doesn't matter. <laughs> anyway, let's get into some tank story action today, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, we're on Pacific Island. Not a particularly good map to have this tank on. Because you want to be as far away as possible, because the German, the German, the British engineers were like, Alright, we got ourselves a good tank, just good solid gun, good solid armor. And then the drunk guy in the back's like, wait, we need a giant command hatch. And the guy's like, why? Cause we'll always have the high ground. That's a good idea. Yeah. And then we have this piece of shit. That is the 87. Today. It's just the command hatch ruins it. It doesn't have any other obvious weak spots. And that fucking command hatch at the front. It's like 200 something millimeters at the front in some places. It's insane in the membrane. Anyway, I digress. Tier 8 game. I always go to the left here because on the right side I've had bad experiences. Oh, what's up? KV2, very strong. KV2 is strong. Don't shoot me in the side, please. Please don't do it. I give you tea. Queen of England is sick. Don't shoot me. I'm not in fucking mood. That is Soviet accent. What the fuck am I doing? Ooh, KV5. I want KV5. Wouldn't mind having it. Godzilla! So creeping along at our steady pace of about 20 kilometers per hour, k miles, k miles per hour. Focus on this area. Once we get up here, we'll get take shot after shot after shot into our command hatch. Indeed, you do. Already lost three tanks, really. Both of our light tanks and one medium. Hey, we pulled one back. We killed ourselves a challenger. Nice. Now, if we can get to the battlefield anytime soon, we can see those guys from here, can't we? Uh, don't move, dude. Hey. Ooh. These are, these are bad shots we're taking here. Ah. Where is the accuracy I was promised? Damn it. Accuracy, schmaccuracy. I mean, that was those are hard shots to make. They're crossing over the middle, and the right. Oh fuck, Indian Panzer. Never get good shots on people, and the gun is so put low in the tank that they can see you come over a hill long before you can even shoot at them. It's just a pain in the buttocks. We need just a good bush to find. Bush is wunderbar. Nice. Thanks us the kill there. Guy gonna come across this open ground here. Ready to fire. You track him? No. Somebody else did. No, not yet. No, 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 no. Gotta move. One more time, reload. Nice kill there. He penetrated 
killed our driver. Shit, there's a freedom and Indian hands over here. Legion, actually. Why did I say freedom? I'm writing stuff here on the lead. Churchill wore glasses for a reason. Panther 88 needs help, but I can't get over there fast enough to do anything. The hammer should be able to take care of the legion, though. He's running away. You lost an ally. Seven to seven. We got three tanks left on this flank. Most of the enemy team looks like they're on the other flank. Ooh. 229. You're patient. Calculating. Don't move, sunshine. Nice. Come on, Firefly. Come on back. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. Nice shot, Tiger. Of course we missed. Don't pull forward, dude. Oh, come on. You turd. Back up. Ooh. How do we hit that? RNG is strong with this one. Seven hits, four kills. Not bad. I will take it for our first game on this map. Of all maps. We're capping the base, so it looks like most of their team should be falling back. Yag Tiger should be a problem. Tiger 2, not as much of a problem, but still a problem nonetheless. Man, it's just hours of boredom, seconds of excitement with this thing. You're, you're going at like 20k miles an hour trying to find somebody to at least shoot at. And once you get there, it's like, ah, and then either you die or you kill them all, and then it's boredom again. Once that tank store dies, we're the only thing over here. Actually, no, there's a 228 prototype. Got our base. It's a medium, yep. Yeah. Prototyping will last long against two tanks on him. I can finish off his tiger, though, if I can get around this corner fast enough. Back up, back up for me, sunshine. Come on. I know you want to. Don't let yourself die by that 228 prototype. Oh, he bounced it. Now can we come in and secure this kill? Maybe get us the top gun if we go back to the base fast enough? Nope. Valiant defense there, lad. Both of them are in our base. We just won. Nice! Four kills, eight hits. One critical. I will definitely take that. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, back on Sacred Valley. Tier 7 maximum game. Better matchmaking than the last game. Will we do the same? I guarantee you not. We'll probably get killed really early. We're going to this spot right here. About right here, in between these two squares right here. And shoot down into these areas down here. That's where I was at uh, one game. Me and the T28 prototype was sitting there blazing away, roasting people. So we're going to see if we can do that again. That was a tier 9 game. Uh, I got four hits. And that was it. Let's see if we can do any better this game. Oh, what's up, dude? SU-152. I still have my... I don't have my SU-100 anymore, but I... I do have it fully upgraded. But... I just haven't had the... The will to go down that line yet. There's just so many tanks. So many, so many tanks to choose from. Yeah. There's, there's like barely any heavy tanks to go down anymore. Besides French. And they're not even really heavy tanks. They're like mediums. There's not even that. See, like, look at all these juicy targets down this, down this way. And we can sort of hide our our uh, command hatch around this hill right here. Come on, dude, come on out. I swear he was coming out. Can we not see that far? We can't, can we? Shit.
Damn. Wait, hammer. Don't do it. Oh, there's two hammers. Yeah. Command hatch. Great shot about a lot of tanks now. Probably got right there. Nope. We're bad. Churchill 7. Oh, fuck. Churchill 7, here he comes. Get a shot on him. Tracked him. Shit, they're coming this way. No, they're going up the middle there. I see that. Turret front's weak. There we go. Flat armor's always a good target to shoot at. He's not tracking him. Why did he move him? That went right through his gun. <laughs> the penetration on this thing's really good. I really don't have to load that much APCR. But it's whatever. Alright, that guy's down. Hammers are getting shot in the butt. We got plenty of teammates that way, so we're going to keep looking this way. Since that guy's down, he should come this way. No, he's going to go keep going up the hill. I would go on flank, but then my ass is towards all those guys over there. Hmm, decisions, decisions. In any battle, in any battle. In any battle, in any battle, yeah. In any battle, in any game. One decision can control what happens in the battle. Your decision carries lots of weight. Where do you tank the machine? What tank do you shoot at first? What kind of ammo did you load? I really want to, don't want to go over there. What's this guy? Is he close? No, he's really far. Mmm, I don't like the way this looks. Three teammates left over there. Three on three. Two on three. You guys, a one shot right there. Yeah, we're outnumbered very bad. We're gonna hopefully f roll back to a defensible position. Lost another tank. There's just one left up there, and he's dead too. So we're next. We just gotta give us our, give our best fight. Try to take as many of the bastards with us as we can. We're the last tank on our team. Come around that corner right there. Kill both these hammers if we're smart. Come on. Damn, we got artied. We got one of them. The other one got away. And now the lone already silent ghost fights to defend his home country. How long is he gonna survive? Let's take bets. I got bets on 30 seconds. He's getting away quite nicely, quite nicely. He's gonna turn and fight. What a sensible man. He's got one mark of excellence. Nope, tiger behind him. Tiger somewhere. I, how can I kill? Holy crap. 10 hits! 3 criticals, 2 kills. I will take that as well. 2,000 damage, oh my goodness. Top of the team. Suck my dick, everybody. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Final battle here on this map, Westfield. And it's raining, so our traverse is a lot better. I always mention that every time it's raining. It's a tier 9 battle. Unfortunately, we're at the bottom of the list. There are two tier 7s on our team, and we are one of them. Uh, aside from that... A good map for tank destroying. Uh, this thing up here, yeah, this whatever you fucking call that ridge thing. I call it lots of things ridges, but it's whatever. Uh, get up there, find you a bush. You can do some pretty good tank destroying. But however, they will come from their own side up this way. They will meet resistance. We have three heavy tanks. They have like six. Seven. I have to count some real quick. Look how many meters we got. Eh. Yeah. One ten. 
We don't have a single tier 9 heavy tank. They have plenty. We'll see how this battle turns out, ladies and gentlemen. Steven the man. AT-15, that's my next tank. I'm going to grind and try to get that. I really want to get the Death Star soon. Really feeling the Death Star in my mind right now. Or the Doom Turtle. I got the T-25 AT. Maybe that'll be the next video. Start grinding some tank destroyers. Type 61 up here. Jefferson, go! Is this... The Uber? What's that guy's... Uber. That's his. I thought it said Uber. Support this uh, T-54 up here. It's so boring driving to where you're wanting to go. Can we get in range with seeing those dudes over there? The sun decided to come out for once, and I can't see the right side of my screen. It's just window. Hello. Ready to fire on target. Good shot there, lad. Medium right there. What is it? Indian Panzer. He dead now. Hell no. Time sixty-one. Camo net deployed. That bush right there would be perfect. But I mean, it hinders our progress of aiming downwards. We have to like get like inside of it or even over it. See, we can't aim down. But in a T28 or T28 prototype, that thing would be lit. Something with good gun depression. A stir mill would be excellent. Can't see any of those dudes over there. Our view range is not wunderbar. However, we can't aim up that far. There we go. If we knew, we can. Oh shit. Maybe we should start shooting this Type 61. I'm not gonna get roasted, but whatever. Hello, comrade. I'm detected. Whoa, from the right side of the city. Somewhere on the right, there is a bathroom on the right. Grievous Bob. General Grievous. Kenobi. Tiger 2 over there snooping around. When you're ready, come and get it. Na 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 na. Na 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 na. When you're ready. When you're ready. Shit. Negative. Affirmative. Negermative. Target's on here? Too far away. 61. Target Dang. You're patient. Calculating. And you know the best defense is a very, very big gun. You are a tank destroyer. This thing ain't got a big gun at all. It's like every British tank in the game has a fucking 20 pounder, 17 pounder gun. Like why? Change it up a bit. Ah, I came up. What am I doing? It's like War Thunder. The British tanks, you have to pick apart your the crew and or modules with each shot because the shells are so small. But with a big ass gun like a Soviet has, you can one shot people, everybody. Like, well, why? Why? Why, British? Why are you doing that? Because the Queen of England likes everything small. Oh, the King's Nick is small, eh? I'm just messing with you, British. You're pretty cool. I mean, you gave us tea. That's pretty sweet. I drink tea every day. Granted, it's sweet tea, but it's still tea nonetheless. And you gave us this glorious tank we call the AT-7 with the giant-ass commander hatch on top. Nice! You got a kill. Let's push up with our teammates here. We're not doing much back here. I mean, we just killed T-29, but that's just T-29. 
Oh, hold up. Our base is wide open. Yep. Let's turn around. We could be the difference between victory and failure. Because that art is the only thing left to defend the base. We can keep them from capping. Maybe our teammates can go and cap their base. Thought process is key. Definitely. It's a cute little flowers. One of them out there is blue. And it's perfect. But you won't find it. And our teammates are dying. And we're last attacking on our team again. Once the T-54 dies. Like, really, bruh? What are you looking at? There's enemies behind you. Map awareness, dude. Oh, my goodness. You know there's tanks coming this way, right? Hey. Dipshit. Wow, he's heavy. I didn't even budge him. There are tanks coming this way. At least they were. If not, I'm kind of upset. Yep, T-54 is dead. Help! Help what? Focus attention here. Nobody left to help except me. I'm covering your ass. All you wear T thirty fuck. It's up to us. There's no one left. The final stand of the lone tier seven. We can clutch this. There's always a chance to clutch it, but it's very, very minute. Where's C three PO when you need him to tell the odds? Enemies looking right at us. You can kill us the challenger. Reload one more time. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. <laughs> Missed. It must have went right over him. Did you see that? Oh. It's over. Everyone fall back. Oh man, we almost had it. Lost silver. Five hits, one kill. Definitely not bad, but if you lose and don't do that much damage, you don't really get much. Like, look, this guy did almost 3,000 damage at the top, only got 600 XP. But, a, a same guy that did like 1,000, got 871. This guy did almost 3,000 too. Just, just a little bit more than the top guy. Look how much more silver, I mean, XP he got. That's the difference. That's the difference between winning and losing. Anyway, Papa Sarge is out for today, and no, I'm kidding. <laughs> that, was, that was dumb. Hope you all enjoyed this video. That's how I'll do it for today. Uh, get out there, get you whatever tank you want. Get this fucking T20, T20. 2017 shit out of here. Stop at the fireworks. That was three days ago. Hope you all are having a, a, a new year so far. A good new year so far. New Year's resolutions coming on nicely. I'm Sarge, signing out.